Hello friends, welcome to the Urban Homestanding channel. If this is the first time you're visiting our channel, we want to extend to you a very warm welcome and invite you to watch any of our over 560 videos that we've arranged for your convenience in playlists as we are confident you're going to find something both useful and entertaining to watch. If you've been here before, welcome back. If today is your birthday, woohoo, happy birthday. Today we have another interesting first look for you, as these are videos that you have told us that you enjoy and we do enjoy making them. So today we're going to look at another hard tool, and this time it will be for uh, Mrs. Wizard. It's one of her favorite activities ever, right? Guess what it is! Yeah, can you guys guess what it is? We'll leave you in suspense. But we're going to tell you it is from heart. A few weeks ago, a few weeks ago we were working at Walmart and in their clearance they had this tool for $30 which was the tool, the battery that comes with the tool and the charger which was a, a fantastic uh, deal so we bought it, we weren't planning to buy it but we were looking for a hard tool to test so we did purchase it and since then we have been quite pleased with it, right? Mm -hmm. today we came across another hard tool and again this is for uh, Mrs. Wizard and, and this time we have the big batteries, the super duper professional charger, and the tool itself. Ta -da 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 -da. Anyone can guess it? Anyone can guess it? It is an orbital sander that it is cordless. The first cordless orbital sander we ever had actually, right? Yep. This is the first for our little channel. So we're going to open those with you guys and see if the excitement worth it or not. Sorry to turn you turn my back to you, but we're doing a proper unboxing this time, you know? Maybe you should have been doing it. To your tool. Right? <laughs> the mandatory and never used um, manual. It comes with a little uh, um, bag style dust collector and based on what I've read about it it is easy to attach yeah to a vacuum so you can attach it to a vacuum there because you have the battery here it looks pretty good anything else in the box oh honey I was gonna say does it come with any sanding disc it comes with sanding disc it doesn't tell us what they are they look like either 60 or 80 what do you think mm. it says actually <laughs> Yeah, that's a... T okay, you were way off. 220. What that one says. That looks very rough for 220, this doesn't one, it? I think they're, oh, they are they're different. layered. Yeah. Okay, because I was like, I cannot pick that off. I have a general idea what I'm talking about. Some of the time. And I think this is it. Now, as we showed you a moment ago, we also have this uh, charger, which is very different than the charger that came with our inexpensive kit which is this non-descript one right yeah it's more of a almost a portable charger than what you would expect from a, a power tool i won't make you wait for me to get over this because for some reason i have a hard time opening it right now so we'll be right back as, after we open it all right heart if you're listening to us this is ridiculous this is an invitation to injury right it's extremely sharp very very hard to pull apart and both uh, Miss Wizard and I had to work together to make sure that this thing allowed access to our batteries, right? Yep, we used a blade and that wasn't tough enough to get through the plastic. Right, in fact, I mean, I don't even and so you can see it. And trying it open with fingers is extremely dangerous. I think this is an opportunity for improvement. And of course, because we are collecting things that we're not going to use, I'm going to take the information too, as well, right? And there is a win. Review to win. Maybe we'll get more uh, tools. Review the hard tools to win. There you go, guys. Very cool. If 
five winners each month. Now we are not sponsored by Walmart and the kit is the orbital charger, the two four amp hour batteries and the charger, right? Well, the sander, the battery. Right, I said that, orbital yeah. sander, yeah. Uh, which is an unbelievable price, don't you think? Yeah. If you consider that this alone is like $69 by itself and Miss Wizard corrected me, the kit we bought for $30 for clearance included both of these, one battery and the entry level charger right so we lucked out with this this was a very good uh, purchase this we haven't used yet but we're going to use and we're going to give you our first impressions in, uh, in a moment now these two batteries themselves are $99 so if you consider you get the two batteries the tool and the fast charger for $99 I think this is an awesome deal right and they're lithium-ion and what's the yeah. voltage on them these are 20 volts all the hard tools are 20 volt but these are four amp hours batteries and, and to show you the difference the one that we got with our $30 kit is a one and a half amp hour battery so I suspect you, you can see the difference right yep so I suspect that this is going to even be more impressive now with a more powerful battery you would think so and we I mean we've been very pleased I have been using this tool ever since we've got it I think almost exclusively right I really like it I, I must admit I really like it I'm a little concerned about the white and making it dirty I don't think I've made it dirty yet what do you think no and I mean sawdust doesn't make things dirty I'm told all the time by right Mr. by me Wizard. but it's Dr. Wizard thank you very much <laughs> <laughs> but I think if you're a mechanic that might be an issue right if you have a lot of oil in your hands and things like that that might be an issue because it's white I do like the look of the machine but Maybe they'll come up with a, a um, power drill, power screwdriver Cleaner? case, oh. like you do for your phone to protect it. All right, but still it will, it will get dirty regardless. Or a hat, something. So again, uh, I want to show, because we got confused with all our previous stuff, so what came and what it will be in a $99 kit is a collection of uh, paper, sandpaper, the orbital device itself, two four amp hour batteries, and one uh, charger, which is an upgrade from the old charger. I think this is the first charger actually, and has LED lights to tell you what is happening. Where this is a much more basic thing, right? This is a much more basic device, and I believe the kit will also come with this um, deal that you can get a gift card. And if you win the gift card, effectively the, the tool becomes free for you because it's a $99 uh, tool for a $100 gift card. Mm -hmm. So again, for all, everything you get, $99 is a very, very competitive price. You couldn't buy another brand for the same price. No, you, not, not, not all those things. Yeah. Now, to be fair, we've never priced and never even seen a, a cordless orbital sander. Right, but still, I mean, you couldn't. And we know, for example, that the cobalt that uh, Elpida bought was $149, the cobalt kit. So we know that there is the difference. Mm -hmm. You cannot get, and it didn't have two batteries. It only came with one battery, you know, so, and it was a low end battery, the 1.2, like the little battery, not the big battery. Impressions. Uh, it has a pretty good grip. It has a positive, you will probably like this because it's a positive button. Mm -hmm. You know if it is on or off. Oh, I hope you know if it's on or off. And I'm going to give it to Miss Wizard because she will probably use it more to just hold it on her hand and and tell me what she thinks. You want me to put the battery it's on it? It's fairly lightweight, but it, it's got a, an easy grip to it. Let's see how loud it is. Right? Or how loud it, how heavy it gets with battery. And there it is with the battery. Not extremely loud, actually. It, it, it's pretty good. Mm -hmm. You like this? Uh, I see the literature that you can it's put. It's almost like it's wearing a little jetpack. That's cute. Yeah. <laughs> uh, the this can be connected to a hose, but I think that defeats the purpose because if you have it here, it becomes really portable, right? Right. If you have a hose to to keep it, I don't think it's very loud. What do you think? Hold it now that's on and tell me what you think. It's pretty lightweight. 
Can you do any golf with one hand? Okay. I can if I'm not holding a camera. Right. So, I'm going to charge these. I presume they come with at least half a charge. Well, I presumed wrong. Actually, these have an LED that tells you. I didn't know that. So, this is almost completely discharged. Mm -hmm. And I presume it will be the same with... Yeah. yeah. Now, traditionally, most uh, batteries come with half a charge. So, I don't know if that's kind of a pre-production thing and it is not charged. But in any case, ours came with only one bar of charge. Not fully discharged, but not charged by any means. My impressions, uh, based on the fact that we did know how hard felt because we have the other two tools already, it is exactly what I expected. It feels good. It doesn't feel poorly constructed. It's a very um, tough feeling, durable plastic for the body. And I think you will enjoy not having to deal with a cord. I think that would be oh, a, yeah. a big... Uh, it gets in the way when you're sanding. Right. So we're looking forward to use this and more than likely, I'm sure Miss Wizard will find a way to use it in our next build. She will find something that needs to be sanded, right? Sure. The construction is good. Thumbs up for me. The fact that uh, uh, Hart is taking a page from Ryobi, or Ryobi, as it's correctly pronounced, which is again the the cousin of Hart. They are both made by TTI. The, the mother company that makes this tool is the same. So we see TTI going the same way that they went with Ryobi. One interface battery works on all the tools. Mm -hmm. And I think that is a smart idea. What do you think? Definitely. Because you don't want to just end up with all kinds Definitely of different batteries. Definitely increases customer loyalty to a brand because you can buy more tools and use the same batteries if right. that's an issue. And that's what we have done with our IOB. We have a connection, collection of batteries. Miss Wizard used it, all of it in, in her weed eater the other day, but you know, we have two, four, six, eight Ryobi right, batteries. Advantage, you know? What do you think of the, the color scheme? I mean... Yeah, I'm not crazy about the white, but you know, tools are meant to get dirty, right? And you like this, the, the little backpack look yeah, of the... jetpack. <laughs> yeah, and really even with the battery, it is not heavy, it's not any heavier than our other mm -hmm. Sanders actually, which is surprising to me because um, the majority of this is um, the hard durable plastic rather than any metal parts. Right. I presume it will get heavier when you attach a hose here, but also it will minimize, you probably get zero, uh, what do you call it, dust. Right. And we do, to be fair, we have the smaller battery on mm -hmm. here, not the one it came with. But we can, we can fix that. Really it doesn't come with the battery. It, that's why it came in different boxes. Mm -hmm. You can try it. It doesn't feel much different to me, but you can tell me. Well, yeah, that's, it, it's more, I mean, obviously it's heavier. So you will prefer it with a smaller battery than versus Probably. a big one. Depending on how long it lasts. Well, these are more than double the capacity. Four amp hours versus one and a half amp hour. So things we like, and I presume that Miss Wizard likes that too. I, I like this very positive on-off switch. We had one that you had to hold it in order to stay on and mm. really Miss Wizard hated oh, that one. That wears you out. Right. So this, and I like that you can look at it and know because it has this standard uh, little outcomes, you know, the, not outcomes, ridges. Mm -hmm. So you can look at and know what it, where it is. So that, that's very, very nice. It has the standard um, loop style sandpaper, which is also very good, I think. Yep. You can use materials you're used to. So, definitely I would say that if we're at Walmart and I, I find a really good deal on another hard tool, like I did in those two, for 30 bucks, I mean, that was amazing. Uh, even if it is not a kit at this stage, uh, I would probably buy it if it's like for 10 bucks or something, you know. Because we have the batteries already, so we, we are there. So, we added that we were not intending to add another brand in our stable. Because we have Ryobi and we have Rigid and we have Black Denker. What else we have? That's it, right? Ryobi, Rigid and Black Denker and Cobalt. Mm -hmm. uh, but this happened fortuitously to, to drop on our lap, so we took advantage of it. Is there anything you don't like? Well, I, I don't think it's fair to say right off the bat. Well, first look. After I use it, we'll, well but, see. But, but that's in the um, review. I, I don't see anything not to like. 
And this is very typical. Actually, this looks very similar to our Ryobi. Other than the fact that it's not lime green and it's white, right? Mm -hmm. Too bad the, the batteries are not interchangeable. That, that would be cool. All right, folks. This is interesting. Very interesting batteries. I, I like them. I should have used my... I have a scale. I should have brought it and uh, see how heavy they are. So thumbs up for me. My first impression is very positive. And having the experience of the tool that I have used for uh, a little over a month now, I expect it to be a very good tool. But as always, we're going to do a follow-up review to tell you what we think as we use it, right? Miss Wizard? Yeah, I think, I mean, we definitely want to give it a good try. Um, but it looks nice. It feels nice. And uh, we'll see how it works out. Do you think the price point is good? If our viewers go out and, and spend $99, do you think that's a reasonable price point for the things you're getting? Well, I definitely think that anytime you can get a power tool like that with batteries included for under $100, that's a steal. Yeah, I think so too, you know. So, we hope you enjoyed this episode. We certainly enjoyed bringing it to you. And if you did, we'll appreciate the thumbs up. If you didn't, the other button works as well. Share, like, and if you have not done so, subscribe. And if you do, also really click the notification button so you know every time we post a new video, which is Wednesdays and usually Saturdays, midweek and, and the weekend, right? Mm -hmm. That's our normal st schedule. From Dr. Wizard, Mrs. Wizard, and the Urban Homesteading Channel, stay safe, put your masks on, wash your hands, and we're going to see you in the weekend with another build. Stay safe, friends. Hello, friends, and welcome to another episode of the Urban Homesteading Center.